on the homeward stretch now. You can see the escarpment on the horizon. On my way back from getting a truckload of supplement. Sourced out my patty mix this year. Just had to simplify things. There's too much going on. So I had to simplify the workload. Which costs a little bit of money. But by the time, you know, we put a lot of time into mixing patties and balancing out the protein profile and, and then deriving this supplement just to add layers of complexity to the whole mix and everything like that. I would say we're pretty focused in on the, uh, the recipe and the product that we want to provide our bees. So because I'm not mixing my product this year, I'm releasing some of that control to somebody else. I'm not exactly sure the entirety of the recipe that these guys use in their mix, but I'm sourcing it through Global, which is pretty much the supplement that I mix at home. It's a soy flour brewer's yeast protein base. And I can only assume that they're balancing out the protein profile much the same as we did adding bits and pieces here and there but I've also had them add that uh, Apis Biologics just to add the layer of complexity that I'm after within my patties so I got a lot in that truck right now and a truckload of protein patties spending money 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 that is what a year's worth of patties look like well, I could feed a lot more than that, but I feed very specifically. I feed for a purpose. So I make sure I focus on the points of time, which will pay back in dividends. Cannot wait to get these on the colonies. I mean, I'm not feeding this stuff to try to replace that natural pollen coming in. If I had pollen, the great abundance of pollen, I would not be wasting my money on supplement. But the problem is I don't always have pollen because, you know, I leverage this as a livelihood, you know, because this brings in, allows me to bring in this massive honey crop. This provides opportunity, but this also creates the problem as we manage those lands. I'm losing that diversity, the lack of diversity. I'm just losing, you know, the, the resilience within my colonies, the health. So what I'm trying to do here is fortify their diet provide them the nutrients they need. Develop out a healthy nest. Fill in those holes and then make me the money. Ooh, I can't wait. I can't wait, I can't wait. Oh, that's pretty good. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing wrong with that. Hello. Just about done. Holy smokes, you're crazy. Yeah, I think we've got more of a stack out in the back, but I'm not digging for that. <laughs> <laughs> I've already done through that one, I'm not digging for that. Adding cleats on to the sixes. Can you uh, show that fit onto the box? Put 
foamy on there. This will keep the load a little more secure. Strap her down, getting some pallets made up to build interlock. Rock and roll. And the queen stable. <laughs> Alrighty, so how many do we have left here? We'll see what's in the snowbank first. 